20% of Utahns that experienced food insecurity. It's time for Utah to eliminate the food tax. There is a renewed push to eliminate the sales tax on food in Utah. As Fox 13 News first reported last week, the state does have a surplus of hundreds of millions of dollars. And as Fox 13's Ben Winslow reports, some community leaders say it's time to share that wealth with needy families. A gospel song kicked off an effort by religious leaders, anti-hunger activists, and Democratic lawmakers to eliminate the sales tax on food. But even the tax collectors came to be baptized. With the Utah State Legislature seeing as much as a billion dollars in revenues and surplus, they say it's time to eliminate the sales tax on groceries. I just can't imagine it being okay to, to stockpile a billion dollars and then say, well, we're going to take $14 from everybody. Reverend Vanetta Golf and Wilkerson runs a food pantry in West Valley City. We've been hitting record numbers, over 200 families in a two hour period, two, three hour period. Utah is one of 13 states that still has a sales tax on food. Anti-hunger activists say it harms lower income families. The grocery tax is the most impactful one for low income families when it comes to sort of your day to day existence. The legislature has consistently rejected the idea of eliminating a sales tax on groceries. But in an interview with Fox 13, Governor Spencer Cox did not oppose the idea. We're looking at it for sure. But the governor says it may not be a repeal on the tax on food. We are going to do a, a tax cut this year. Um, I, I think there's there's broad agreement on that. What that looks like, um, we're working on some ideas around that. Um, maybe a, a tax credit for families uh, that will help them with food and, uh, and, and with the rising inflation that we're seeing right now. People who are living day to day, paycheck to paycheck, can't wait for a rebate to come at the end of the year. And some of these people don't make enough money to file in the first place. It's just not um, the best solution. Democrats will try to push a bill in the next legislative session. I hope that as a legislature, we don't squander the opportunity. But if the legislature refuses to act, some warn a citizen ballot initiative is possible. I don't even want to talk about a ballot initiative. I think we're, that the legislature is when you look possible. at, I think it's possible, yeah. On the Hill, Ben Winslow, Fox 13 News, Utah.